Hey, everybody, it's me, Infinite. Send you guys lots of love, light, and peace into your world. Okay, so I started shuffling, and it was like seven minutes in just by shuffling all of these cards because I got a few different decks. So thank you for old and new subscribers. Thank you so much. If you're new to this channel, welcome and blessings and abundance to you guys, okay? So this reading is going to be about your next partner, okay? What's your next partner? What's going on, okay? So the first group is a pen. Next group is geranium oil. The third group is a uh, incense stick. The fourth group is bergamot. The fifth group stick is I mean the fi fifth group is um a um, selenite stick. The last group is this lipstick, okay? Pen group 1, geranium group 2, incense group 3, let your intuition guide you. Group 4 is bergamot. Group five is selenite. Group six is this um, lipstick stick, okay? All right, so I am going to go on to the first group. Let's push these up. There we go. So, pen group one. So what's this future partner? Is this future partner okay? So it looks like this part, this future partner, is hardworking. This person really works hard, and they take um, their jobs really seriously. All right, um, they know how to um, basically um, show face at work, and they also know how to be themselves at home. So when they're at work, they're a different person. Like very professional. Um, um, time always on time but when they're home they're social they're just ch relaxing um hanging out enjoying themselves having a good time making jokes so if they they um use profanity at home okay they won't use it at work they're just very professional okay um this person is a very patient person like they know that it takes time for things to come together and to work um work out for you so they're they know that and they're okay with that they're like okay i'll wait you know i'll wait for this to come through i'll wait for this to change and come around this person looks like it's a virgo okay this person's uh, either if they're if, um if they're not a virgo or they have virgo in their chart that you'll be meeting them in virgo season so i feel like you're gonna be, it's earth something a lot of earth with this car with this group it's a lot of earth so this group seems like this person that you're going to meet is a lot of earth in their chart, okay? And um, you are going to be meeting this person. If you didn't meet them last Virgo season, you're going to meet them this Virgo season, okay? So Virgo season is going to be a big thing, all right? Because um, there's a lot of healing and work that this person is doing with themselves as well as you are. Um, so the time that's going to be best for you to meet with this person is going to be Virgo season. So this is a very exciting time. Some of you guys. Um... Yep, Virgo season. All right, something about nine, nine days, nine weeks, nine months, something about that. Um I heard 11 days, 11 weeks, 11 months, something like that for somebody, somebody that is supposed to resonate with. Um, some of you guys, 16 days, 16 weeks, 16, um, 16 months, somebody 14 days, 14 weeks, 14 months, um, somebody eight days, eight weeks, eight months. All right. Um, somebody it's a month. But most of, the, most of the people, this is the, the fall season is going to be a good time to be meeting this person, okay? Um, so the Mar the um, the Myron, the Mariam, right? Um, this is definitely a life partnership. This person is definitely a soulmate life partner. This is like your other half. So as you continue to work on yourself, you are working, you are working to prepare to be with that person because they're going to be very similar to you, like an equal balance relationship, okay? Um, something about uh, an idea coming and and for you and your personal life connecting like it, it feels like that person like has a brilliant idea they really want to um, um bring it forth 
So it's within their mind and they're working on it very hard to bring it forth as well as you are because you guys are reflections of each other. Um, this person wants to only have people that are loving in their life. They're not looking for people that are full of drama, problems. They don't want any of that. Um, the frequency of conce um, conception invites us to bring our consciousness to our origin, the place where everything is created, be where creation begins. It helps us to remember that the infinite potential and possibilities of this space and what we can manifest through our own focused awareness and attention. So helping you to manifest this person sooner than later conception okay recognizing where everything began how it's connected to you and how you can manifest through knowing that okay so this person is very strong this person's hard working okay they know how to separate business from pleasure they know how to make things happen okay they are full of ideas they're brilliant they're grounded they know how to make money they know how to work with their finances balance things out um they are um, going to have some things shifting for them. They're, they're, they're on point. They are not playing. And they love to be by themselves. They don't mind being alone. They do not mind being alone, okay? Um, but when you and that person connect, this is a life soulmate, life partnership. So this is meant to be. So um, continue to work on yourself. Continue to utilize the laws of attraction and, and, and you can pull it in sooner than later, okay? So the affirmations for this group is, I'm carefree. <laughs> you don't have to be so serious all the time. I'm carefree. Spirit said, just say, I'm carefree. Affirm that you're carefree, you know? Not take life so seriously, right? Calm it down, right? <laughs> we all learn that. Okay, so the next one is geranium. So group two, thank you guys for liking, subscribing, and sharing. The next group is now Geranium. Please share this video. Thank you so much. Okay, so this group. Okay, so if you, Taurus season. So you guys may meet this person during Taurus season. If you're not meeting them through, if you haven't met them through this Taurus season, you'll meet them through next Taurus season or seven days, seven weeks, seven months, um, four months for some of you guys, five months, five weeks, four weeks, uh, five weeks for somebody, uh, 14 days, 14 weeks, 14 months. Okay. So keep those dates in mind for some of you guys, whomever, whichever date is supposed to resonate with you know that you are manifesting a partnership. Okay. Somebody who is very intellectual, very intelligent, okay? This person, um, they can um, close up this partnership, the next partner. This person may be kind of closed off, right, because of, um, you know, life. Um, so they kind of shut down when things get kind of too much for them to bear or too much for them to handle um, because of stress. So they kind of close off. Um this person has kind of like has issues. Excuse me. This person has kind of like issues with asking for help and asking for assistance. Um, cause they, they're still working on their throat chakra. So when you meet with this person, they may still have issues, um, uh, going on when it comes to their throat chakra, speaking up, um, communicating, um, being truthful and honest of what they want and what they need. Like they can tell you, but they just, there's still things. They just, they have a lot of, um, releasing they need to do so that they can feel free and confident, and comfortable in themselves. Okay. Um, you can manifest something great, something better, but this person is going to help you. Not only are you helping them by being around them, they're going to help you by um, being connected to you. So you guys are going to be, it's its a part of your healing. So this person is going to be very helpful um, with you. Um, there's a lot of waiting. There's been a lot of waiting for you in your life and you're finding love or partnerships and, you know, being connected to people. And this person waits, um, knows how to wait and be patient, but at the same time, they they need to communicate better. So there, this I feel like with you connecting to this person, you're going to help them as well as they're going to help you to be truthful and honest and real with yourself. Um, 
This person is um, physically fit. Um, I keep looking at this card, the strong back. They just have a, uh, they're working on a strong foundation. They're working on stabilizing themselves, right? Um, but it's been, it's, it's a lot of things they have to come communicate in order for them to get to that place and so well as you so you this person is um a healing person so you guys are going to be healing so this connection is about healing each other healing so blues wearing a lot of blues is going to be very beneficial so the next person next partner this is about you know someone healing this is about a healing partnership healing people healing um and being able to express yourself truly yourself. So this person is going to help you and you are going to help them get to the next stage of who they really are. Okay. So this is a lot of healing um, in this partnership and this connection. Um, a lot of communicating. Okay. Um, and a throat chakra came out. So this is all about like you need to communicate with this person. So some of you guys have already met this person. You're not being honest with you, who they, what you feel. Some of you haven't, and when you meet this person, you're going to have to be honest with how you feel. For others of you guys, they have to start being honest with themselves, with you, um, so that you guys can create a firm, firm foundation. But uh, overall, I do feel like this is a really healing relationship with being honest and truthful. And like I said, this is around tourist season or four or five weeks, months, um, days. Um, and this is kind of me how long you've known them, or they could be a tourist, or they could be... Uh, an air sign um so either or um they could be like a pisces gemini um if you already met them or you're going to meet them they could have those in heavy in their chart okay so so you gotta communicate all right but this is all about communication. This is gonna this relationship is going to help you to finally, you know, speak up. You know, speak up more. I give love wherever I go. I give love wherever I go. So blessings and abundance, guys, giving love wherever you go is going to be beautiful and powerful. It's really important. Like, subscribe, and share. Thank you so much for following and checking it out. And look into that oil geranium. You might need it. It might be beneficial to you. Okay. So the next. The next one is this incense stick. So let's do this next one is the incense stick. So let's see. I'm going to move these up. Okay. Okay, so we have the queen of wands. So this person is definitely going through a shift and a change. Um, you might meet this person in 21 days. Um, so you might meet them in 42 days, 42 weeks, 21 weeks, um, 21 months, uh, 42 months, um, five days, five weeks, five months. Um, Leo. So you guys might meet this person in Leo season, okay? This person is like a teacher to you, right? This this is a learning relationship, connection, collaboration, this next partnership. This person is going to help teach you, help you to see the world from a different eyes, from different eyes to seeing. Some of you guys already met this person. Um some of you guys are going to meet this person 45 days, 45 um um uh, weeks, months. Um, some of you guys are already connected with this person, but this person is going to help you to break your shell, help you to open yourself up, help you to really be connected with self, right? Um, this person is um, very fiery, okay? So they're very passionate, okay? They're very ambitious. They go for what they want. They seek it. They go, they work hard for it. Um, they're not afraid to be a go-getter, okay? Okay. Um, they are good with, um, conflict resolution, but also they kind of have some, um, some things going on with their set, with their, you know, with people in their lives that are, you know, um, going back and forth. Some just small upsets that are happening, um, but they're getting past it. They're really working on themselves to get past it. Um, 
so you guys may learn something about tantra tantric tantra uh connecting with this person because this is going to be a very passionate connection uh very learning uh help it's like i see her self-awareness that's this is relationships is going to be a very um a relationship about being aware of yourself this person is going to help you to get back to your roots get really connected to your core to your inner self who you really truly are and it's going to be hot and steamy okay um but this next partnership is going to be hot and steamy. But this is this is just someone here that's helping you to teach you, helping you to see the world from a new pair of eyes, helping you to really free yourself from limitations, okay? This person is here to help break your shell, to open you up for what is next to come, okay? This person is here to awaken you, to teach you, to help you to grow. Um, and this person is here to help you get back into your true power of who you truly are. And that is wonderful, amazing, beautiful being that you are, okay? All right, so let's get your affirmation. This person is a beautiful, this person is just hot, steamy, you know? Um, every transition is one step closer to my highest good. Every, once, every transition is one step closer to my highest good, okay? So this person is bringing you just closer to your highest to your next to your real man your male woman okay all right so the next one is bergamot look into that thank you guys for liking and subscribing sharing um this one is next group is bergamot you can look into that oil if you feel led to um so your partner so i'm seeing aquarius season so if you haven't met them yet they may have aquarius having a chart they, um, if not, um, you may meet them in, you've met them in Aquarius season, or you're going to meet them in the next Aquarius season or 44 days, 44 months, 44 weeks, seven days, seven weeks, seven months, um, 23 days, 23 weeks, 23 months. Um, this person is here to help you find, see that love is real. This person is very honest um, and this person doesn't like lies. This person is very um, in, um, aware of themselves, very intellectual. Um, and this person is going to help you move on from other things. Um, and some of you guys have to move on in order to meet this person. Because this person um, may push your buttons. They're going to do a lot of triggering, like triggering you in different areas of your life. But it's all positive because it's bringing you to where you need. Because they're, they want you to love un, um, unconditionally. See, we've been learn we've been learning to love conditional. We've been having conditional love and see this person is coming in to teach you how to love unconditionally, okay? How to move ahead and trust yourself and be successful and abundant and have somebody around you that can be trusted, that can be loving, okay? This person is helping you to see who you are. Okay? This person is going to they will push your buttons, but this is here for your highest good to help you get back in your power, mastering and empowering yourself and your situation. Six weeks, six days, six months um, that you may meet this person or you have already. Um, this person is to teach you how to have faith in yourself, have faith in other people like this. I can see you guys doing business with this person um, and being intimate. Um, but this person is here to teach you about universal love, helping you to see that. There's more to life than just what one thing, two things. Like it's deep and it's beautiful and it's powerful and you have to stay in your power. And this person is definitely in their power. They're very self-aware and they're very intellectual. So they stay in their mind a lot, but they, they, um, with you around, you will help them to find that love again, find love within themselves and within you. And it's both of you guys are like triggering and working with the, each other. Okay. And if you, you know, if you're already in a partnership, you know, this could be some the person that you're with already. Who knows? <laughs> you, this person is here to show you the light that's in the world. Even if they, are, they don't feel, you know, they they stressing you out. They they saying certain things. You, they're here to show you what's really in the world, and it's and the world can be seen as beautiful. Okay. Um, that you can trust people again because some of you guys have lost faith and love and relationships and this person's going to help you see that 
I wake up today with strength in my heart and clarity in my mind. I wake up today with strength in my heart and clarity in my mind. Hey. So, Selenite, thank you guys for liking, subscribing, and sharing. Please share. Peace. So, now we got Selenite. Selenite, number five. Look at number five. Okay. So, let's see. Who's your next partnership? So, one day, one week, one month. Um... 11 one week i said 11 days 11 weeks 11 months um some of you guys five days five weeks five months two days two weeks two months um 47 days 47 weeks 47 months somebody um this person is another leo so another so more leo air energy um so Yeah, so a lot of um, fire and earth element in this group. So this person is like really in their head. Stop it. Turn that off. This person is really in their head. Um, this person got a lot of stuff going on. Um, but this partnership. This is, this is just kind of like a stop, drop and roll type of relationship not really sticking around long term um it's kind of might be a little conflicted in this partnership in this relationship um but this person is here to help you they're gonna help you see some things differently um i've heard something about morals something with like what do you stand for i heard what is it that you stand for okay and it's also here to show you not to settle you don't have to settle um this person is um a thinker they think a lot um then you might be with this person right now or you know you may meet this person but this person isn't the one okay but this person is a part of your journey of learning and growing and moving on to the next level okay to the next place um you hold a lot in your hands with this partnership and you've got to move through everything with grace and realization and power within yourself because it's like a little conflict and energy with this person but it's like they're battling themselves basically this person's like battling themselves and you're coming with them connecting with them and you know they're stop they're battling within themselves and it's like what do you believe your belief system they have a belief system that um doesn't really might not resonate um with who they really want to become because they're battling they're going through a like a dark night of the soul like a shift a change in perception and it's really difficult for them but you're connecting with them at a really difficult time so you are still going to be able to help and they're going to be able to help you in many different ways as well but um this is not like the one okay every obstacle is an opportunity every obstacle is an opportunity every obstacle is not an opportunity i'm carefree i'm carefree so there's a lot of cleansing no wonder selenite but clearing and cleansing so the lipstick here we go Thank you guys for liking, subscribing, and sharing my videos. Blessings and abundance for you guys. So with this group, let's see. This person is a vegetarian. They eat very healthy. This person is not somebody that just does a bunch of stuff. They could be an air sign, Aquarius, um... Aquarius, Gemini, um, water signs, see a lot of water, earth. Um, this person um, is here to help you see better. This person is help is here to help you to change what you're seeing and perceiving. I feel like this person is um, heaven sent. Like, this is a partnership that you're supposed to be in, like, as in love. Like, this person could be a life partner, soulmate. Um, because this person is coming after, coming to you after they realize a lot. Like, a lot of illusions have been lifted. And so they start taking care of their bodies and they start taking care of themselves. And you're meeting them at the time when they're really taking care of who they really are and themselves. You could meet them. You could already have met them or you're going to meet them very soon. This could be a week, a month, a day. Um, um, 
one year could be 33 days 33 months 33 weeks it could have been aquarius season that you met them it could be in gemini season that you will meet them um it could be um but you guys they're telling you that a miracle is happening and this is divine intervention they're coming in to bring you to this person this person is going to help you to to make better choices and this person is here um and you're, it's like you're going to stumble on this man or woman, okay? And this is really, this is real love. This is deep love, divine love. And they're help, they're, you're meeting this person after all of the illusions have been revealed. And you're taking care of yourself better. They're taking care of themselves better. Um, and they're going to love you and take care of you and respect you and honor you. And I'm seeing this is a lot of honor and love, trust. Um, um, they move really quickly. They're releasing all of the stress right now. You are as well. Um, I just see your cup running over. Surely goodness. Okay. This person is going to make you very happy. And it's true love. It's real love. And spirit is like, you can fall and we can, and you'll be caught. Okay. You're not going to fall and you're going to hurt yourself. Like, just embrace your body. Embrace who you are. Embrace what you are becoming. And that is a beautiful being. And you are wonderful and you're powerful. Don't doubt your body because they're going to be reflecting that back to you. So if they, if you don't like your body, they're not going to like your body. Like, you know, it's going to be like reflecting back to each other. I, okay, today I am brimming with energy and overflowing with joy. Today I'm brimming with energy and overflowing with joy, okay? So take care of yourself, take care of your mind, take care of your body and your spirit, and blessings and abundance and peace. Thank you, guys.